Trump is an Atlanta Chick-fil-A part two. My opinion style. Okay, so the article said that he bought 30 milkshakes and some chicken sandwiches, which means that this billionaire did not buy milkshakes and chicken sandwiches for everyone there, which means some of those people who were out there cheering for chicken <laughs> got nothing. We're in the parking lot hungry and heated. Man, I know I would be for sure. Now, there was one lady. I know she definitely got her chicken sandwich and milkshake because she was, like, excited like a contestant on The Price is Right. Like, she's all giving out shout-outs like, this is Morehouse, this is Spellman, this is Morris Brown. We don't care what the news say. We love you, Trump. And they're like, yeah. Now, she seemed like the type who was going to bust out into an impromptu dance, maybe even a song like, we love Trump, Donald J. Trump. In case you didn't catch that, that's the We Fall Down, We Get Up uh, melody. Anyway, I love how Trump's like, give me a hug. And she's like, oh my gosh, I made it. And so she goes to give this dude a hug. Watch the Secret Service agent who's close to the camera. This dude looked hella uncomfortable. Even though this woman was gushing over Trump, he looked like, yo, I got to get this lady's, this black lady's hands off of Trump. He's been holding on to him for a little too long. Now, I don't know if she was holding on because she was using her phone to, you know, use the Apple Pay to buy something with his, with Trump's credit card. I don't know, but he was, she was definitely holding on too long. And that Secret Service agent was definitely uncomfortable. He was like, yo, it's too much cocoa butter, lace fronts, and Carol's daughter in here for me. Get me out of here.